Radio Skid Row 88.9. It's 1950. It's 1950. I thought that's, it was ni- that's 2019. The 20, that's the 24 hour time. Oh, so yeah. Perfect. So it's 7.50. We've got about 10 minutes left. We're going to chop it up at seven minutes and get out of here. Um, we want to wrap it up. But just quickly, we were talking about art just before um, we got off the. The, to topic the, the songs the oh song yeah we break. To the socks yep yep and then uh, to the socks yeah yeah um, we to the song the, break uh, and then uh, Boston Red Sox and we'll talk about art and apparently we've dug up some information and we've snooped into his life and you wanna you wanna introduce uh, no he's right here we've introduced <laughs> <laughs> that part of the scene now so um so so Matt Whiteley Whiteley is a famous name in the art world here in Australia I guess so um is Naomi related to a famous Brett Whiteley uh, no like um Brett Whiteley is a relative, right? Yeah. So Naomi's related through me, I through guess, in now. a weird way. Um, yeah, she Brett, looks Brett, a lot like Brett. That's yeah, why I yeah, thought I saw. it was uncanny. Color, I think, it was uncanny. Yeah. yeah, similar hair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The matter thing is, you both like you got you got similar hair to to um, Brett as well, don't you? If my hair was short, it would be cur- like, like my little, hair little is afro, curly, yeah. but I I it's not curly when it's pulled back pulled in a bun. Like, yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. If it was short, it would be curly. But not as curly as his. Yeah. So uh, Brett Whiteley was my dad's cousin. Mm. So they were first cousins and grew up together and pretty close. But Brett was six years older than my dad. So um, Do you remember him around the house or like ever in the family? Gatherings? I only met Brett once. I, met, I did meet Brett when I was a kid uh, down at the beach. He was down at Whale Beach. I think he spent a, a fair bit of time down there. Where he did a, is that where he did a lot of his art around? Was he a Northern Beaches lad? No, no, no. He was um, originally from like Rose. Oh, I think it's Rose Bay. That oh yeah, yeah, the, yeah. from east the east. Solid, yeah, yeah shout solid. out to the east. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so yeah, Dad grew up in Rose Bay, and um, Brett. Brett was a wild kid. Yeah. Yeah. I started reading his one of his not his but or yours a bio, a biography <laughs> on him. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, you're like, whoa, he's a wild kid. Yeah. Like, like he kidnapped the ne- the next door neighbor's cat and held it ransom Catnap. on top of the garage, like, <laughs> like for real. Like, I w- why? Because <laughs> he wanted something. Oh. Like he, wanted, <laughs> he wanted money, or he wanted I can't remember what yeah, he wanted. Yeah, yeah. He wanted something. So he's like, I'm gonna kidnap their cat, and I'm gonna kill the cat unless you give me what oh, I want. Yeah. Like, he's just a wild. Wild. It's weird, like that. Even from a real young age, like one of those wild kids. Yeah, yeah. there's those kids that are more like I don't know, conscious of who they are when they're little. So they, yeah, they got the confidence to do that sort of stuff. Totally and, knew who he was. Yeah, and go up to people and talk like they're little adults, sort of thing. Yeah, yeah. No, I even freak out on the little.